Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a California redwood. I take one finger at the bottom and I put a dot and from that dot I'm going to draw a slightly wavy line over to the right hand side. I come over here two fingers on the left and I put a dot and from that dot I'm going to draw a slightly curved line up, keep going, keep going, we're going to leave it floating. Now I take two fingers and I put a dot and now on the right hand side I'm going to draw a slightly curved line up, keep going, keep going, and leave it floating. I come over here on the right hand side and I draw one baby circle and next to it I draw another baby circle. I go back to the first one and I draw a little straight line out, curve line up, curve line over, straight line in, jump over, straight line connect. Come inside and draw a curve line, straight line, curve line, straight line in the back. Right here, if you have room, put a little straight line. Okay, now come back over here to the very top. And in between these two, I'm going to put a dot. And now I'm going to draw a curve line down, out, curve line, up, connect. I come on the right hand side and I'm going to draw a curve line. Then I'm going to draw a curve line down, out, up, connect. I come right above and I put a dot and I'm going to draw a curve line down, connect, bring it over to the dot again, curve line down, connect. Come right here in the center where that dot was and now I'm going to come and draw a slightly curved line up, down, connect. On the left, slightly curved line out, in, connect on the right. Come right here at the top and we're just going to draw a curved line up, curved line down, connect. Come inside and we're going to draw slightly curved lines if you have room one, two, and three. Okay? Now, the reason why we drew the little car over here is so that you can see the difference in size from the California Redwood. Alright, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is just add some red stripes coming down on my red wood. Okay? Then I take my brown and I just add over it, double color, brown all the way down over your red so you can see it still a little bit and blend it in towards the bottom. Okay? Once I've done that, I'm going to take green. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a line right underneath my black line. And now I'm going to come up and I'm going to do each section of my redwood tree. Now these are really high up away from the actual tree trunk. That's why it looks this way. So I'm going to do green all the way up and over. Okay, you'll do a better job than me. Then I come back down here and I'm just going to draw another green line because this is the forest. But I'm really going to come back in with my brown. And I'm going to fill this in for the forest floor. Okay? 
all the way across. Give yourself a block of color down at the bottom. Now, you can color your car any color you want. I did mine foam green. Okay. And if you want to do your wheels, I'm going to put a little baby circle inside and then just do a little bit on the outside. Okay. Now, because I'm totally into a pop of color, I'm going to take my blue green and I'm just going to draw straight lines behind across my tree. And it's almost like these straight vertical lines give you an idea again on how huge these redwoods are. Okay? Let's see what it looks like all colored in. Okay, here's my California redwood all colored in and it is the state tree of California. Okay, bye bye.